Hey friends, welcome back to my channel. My name is Erica and I am a wife and a mom. Um, Sayla is our oldest daughter, she is four, Titus is two, and then Caleb will be born sometime in the next month and we're so excited to meet him. But every morning I start out by doing my devotional and then I always do my journaling um, just I always write out a verse for the day and then I always write out my words of affirmation that God says about me. So I have those on my mind and um, thinking about it all day because man, the enemy definitely tries to attack and so I always just want to be prepared trying to put on that armor of God and just keeping it, um, just keeping it up on all day long. So it always starts in the morning. First thing, it doesn't happen first thing every morning, but I really do try because I can tell a difference. But anyways, it's breakfast. Um, so after I do my devotion, um, we eat breakfast. And so the kids are eating some oatmeal and they like milk with it. And I also needed to plan our menu out because I had not had a chance to do it this week yet. And so that is what we're doing. Just planning the menu and grocery shopping because that is also what we have to get done today as well. So this is a very long vlog and I tried to edit it down so many times, but I hope you enjoy it today. Um, this is just my get it all done on my days off of everything that we have to do um, and try to get done. So there's just so much to do sometimes and um, I still didn't even get everything done, which is fine, but we got the most important things done for the day. I hope that you are ready to get some cleaning motiva motivation done with me and also just um, getting it all done. Uh, that's what it's all about today, just getting it all done, getting things on your to-do list done. Mine were just kind of random all over the place, um, but it always feels good to tackle your daily stuff to do. Um, but yes, I, I try not to do a ton of talking so you can just play this along and listen to the music while you're doing whatever you need to do today to get things done.
and then usually after breakfast um, we just um, get ready for the day I took a shower and um, I don't wash my hair every day so it wasn't a hair wash day so I just pulled it back and and I'm not a makeup expert I don't really care to wear that much makeup but I like to put some stuff on just to make me feel motivated and <laughs> I don't know sometimes I don't know how do how do you feel do you feel motivated when you kind of put yourself together like putting makeup on and maybe fixing your hair it doesn't even at least just brushing it or pulling it back into a bun or whatever um, but let me know in the comments what makes you feel motivated if getting ready or not ready and also um, Kayla was moving like crazy so um, I always love to let my husband feel too because it is such amazing miracle and um, I love getting to fill in but also I feel like Caleb ha has moved way more than my other two kiddos so it's kind of fun to fill him and so I'm hoping that he's in a really good position so um, that's exciting So bad, won't you come back to me? I've got you in my head, you're all that I see. I've lost all my chances, I know that I am too late. I'm thinking of you, I'm thinking of you, I'm thinking of you. Wondering if you're thinking about me too. Now it's too late, I know it's too late. Thinking of you And then after I get ready, I get the kids ready, um, brush their teeth. Titus hates his teeth getting brushed, but um, it's just kind of a fight like that every morning <laughs> and night. Um, but usually if I just say, hey, the sugar bugs are going to eat your teeth away, he'll, he usually will open. So, um, but you kind of have to do what you got to do sometimes. But anyway, so then we get the kids ready. Um, looking so stylish, little stud muffin there. Um, and then I'll do Sayla's hair, which usually most of the time she just wants me to leave it down. Which I don't mind it down, but it just always gets in her face where she has a bad habit of putting it in her mouth and eating it so I like when she will let me um, do it but we're getting to that phase where mom is not allowed to do her hair like she just fights it so when she doesn't fight me I love it because I love doing her hair
And I'm kind of like, I don't know, I, I'm a multitasker, so I just am like, okay, well, we're going to leave soon, so I kind of want to just get part of this main bathroom cleaned um, before we left, and then um, I didn't have any toilet cleaner, which was a good thing, because then I was able to add it to our grocery list. But Titus is obsessed with helping me clean too. He loves spraying. Um, but I'm still using my Jaws cleaner, which I love. Um, man, especially that bathroom cleaner is probably one of my most favorite smells. <laughs> um, it just smells so good. Um, but I have been loving it. And if you want to check it out, I do have a coupon code for 20% um, off your order. So you can use Erica Page for 20% off. And I will link the... Um, the website down below. And then we'll just quickly make the beds before we go and get the finish getting Sayla dressed as well. But Sayla wanted to share her memory verse with you all. Um, man, I'm just amazed at how quickly she can memorize. So here she is saying her memory verse. The nice thing is Cody always makes our bed um, and all the blankets on the floor is our kids. Um, they, I feel like, I can't remember what vlog it was, but I was like, oh, Titus, I was praising how good he was doing in his bed because he was doing really good. And then all of a sudden he wasn't doing good. So um, I cannot, we only have a queen size bed and I'm, there's not enough room for to adults and kids so they are not allowed in our bed but if they want to they can sleep on our floor so that's why we have a million blankets on our floor because our kids wake up in the middle of the night and they come into our room which is kind of like whatever I'm at least getting to sleep so um, like I said Titus has been my like big big helper lately he loves doing laundry with me and 
cleaning. He just wants to be a part of it all, which is really sweet. Um, so, and he also knows how to turn on the washer and dryer, which is, can be a bad thing sometimes. Um, but I started that laundry before we left to go grocery shopping and now we're grocery shopping. Um, we also had to go to Costco. So we went to Costco and Aldi and, um, did Walmart too this time around just cause we were, I just felt like doing grocery pickup, you kind of run out quicker and, um, like you heard in last week's vlog that we literally did grocery pickup for three weeks which was nice because then you don't have to get out and do it but i do also miss like picking out our own things and stocking up on all the groceries but this is kind of what it looks like for me to go grocery shopping i just always put everything on my phone follow the list <laughs> and do that um, but our kids kind of got crazy and it was getting close to lunchtime and nap time so um, I didn't get to vlog too much, which it turned out because this vlog is very long, so Which is really exciting. I'm glad to share um, My day with you and kind of what I do our routines um, so we got home put groceries away fed kids lunch and They are actually sleeping. They actually took a really good nap this day, which I feel like my nap time moments are coming to an end <laughs> I don't know maybe they're not but I feel like they mostly are um, so they are both napping and I am doing the dishes because it was um, a very full dishwasher and I needed to get it started and that way I could uh, wash all the vegetables and fruit from the grocery store It's been four weeks since you called And I've been waiting here for you all along I've been waiting here for you all along Where you been? Where did you go? I wonder if you found what you're looking for Wonder if you found what you're looking for It's not too late, I want you back here with me. We never 
Rather be with you than someone I don't know. Now it's like we're living in two separate worlds. Come back to me, say that you won't go. I can't cope without you.
happened. I was just trying to get the kitchen all nice and cleaned up and um, wash all the stainless steel. I'm just using that Jaws kitchen cleaner, which is um, safe to use on like your stainless steel. Um, so that's what I like to use for my stainless steel in the kitchen. Um, and so just kind of trying to wipe down the counter still and the cabinets because, um, man, it just gets messy and dirty in there. I feel like the bathrooms in the kitchen are like the things that I'm constantly cleaning in our home. What is one thing that you constantly feel like you're cleaning in your home? Let me know in the comments below. So then I'm moving on to our bathroom, um, but I noticed uh, my doors were just looking very dirty, um, like in the bathroom and in our hallway. So I just kind of wanted to get those wiped down and cleaned as well. This time around cleaning the bathroom, I should just get in the habit of doing it every time just because they get dirty. Um, so I am just doing that in this bathroom cleaning.
Then moving back into the other bathroom, the kids bathroom, um, to just clean out the shower. And then as you saw, I just finished cleaning the inside of the toilet bowl. So now we're just playing food with my kids while I fold the laundry. Um, they have like a little grocery store and so Sayla was making ice cream. So that's what we were doing while I was folding. It's that multi-task life, right? You gotta clean and play with your kids while you get it all done. But that was the little laundry that I uh, threw in before we left for grocery shopping. Um, and so I try to do one load a day, but sometimes that doesn't happen either so um, but it's nice when it does happen because then I'm not so backed up on doing like three or four loads of laundry <laughs>
And then once we're done with um, doing the laundry, I will put it away quickly and then we will start on doing um, dinner. We had a birthday party to go to t that night, so I was trying to get everything done by a certain time. So I'm making chicken fried rice tonight for dinner and so um, that's what we're starting right now. Um, it's my kids were not a big fan of it and you'll see at the end of this vlog I try a new mop cleaning thing system and it's amazing how much it collected off the ground of Titus's rice
and like I said before, I'm kind of a multitasker, so while dinner's cooking, and you'll see me occasionally stir it, um, I like to put the dishes away that was done that I started earlier. It was just like a one of those days of just kind of like the tedious task that you just constantly have to keep up with in your house that I was doing um, today. Um, but yes, so putting that away so I could refill the dishwasher with all the dishes in the sink and for um, dinner.
So this recipe actually called for <laughs> peas and carrots, but I totally forgot the carrots when I was at the store. Um, so I didn't end up getting them, but we just put the peas in there, which my husband was <laughs> fine with because he's not really a big fan of carrots. Um, and so that, it worked out. It was still really good. <laughs> So we ate dinner and then we um, got home from the birthday party and I hadn't had a chance to clean up the floor from dinner time and there was so much rice on the ground. Um, this is a new mop that I um, had got from Walmart and it was on sale. Um, so I will link it below um, but if you're interested in it, it's amazing that it's kind of like a shampooer. Um, for your floors basically <laughs> um for your like wood or tile floor so i would say like if you have one day i hope to replace like all of our flooring um just to wood floor and this mop will be amazing for that when I, you have all wood floor um but it works in my house too which i like because it's nice just to have that deep clean on your floors um but it definitely and it vacuums so it's like a vacuum plus a like mop, which is really awesome. And I loved it. It worked so good. I think it's the tin, tin co mop is how, how you say it. I'm probably not saying that right. Um, but that's what it is. I'll link it below, but I got it at Walmart on sale. Um, so if it's not $124, it, um, is not on sale because I think it's oh, like $200, but um, I got it on sale, so keep watching at Walmart. It does go on sale. Um, but this is where I end the vlog today, just finishing with the mop, and then uh, you will see how much it collected into the um, container with the dirty water. And I was, man, I was actually really surprised at how dirty the water was um, and how much food was in there from Titus. Um, but I just went ahead and did all my floors. The only bad thing is it didn't fit on that side of the toilet, which is fine. I can easily get down and wipe, wipe it up myself. Um, but yes, um, I am going to end the vlog right here. I hope you guys loved today's, um, cleaning, get it all done with me. Um, and I hope you feel motivated <laughs> just to get whatever you need to done. This was just my catch up day getting all the things done um, but don't forget to like and subscribe to my channel um, I really appreciate your support and thank you for joining me today have a wonderful rest of your day or night or whenever you're watching this God bless